I'm Suzanne Capriol, and I work in the Kitchener PSI office. Um, I worked there since the middle of March, and before that I was working on a PhD in biochemistry at the University of Waterloo. I uh, became involved with PSI two and a half years ago, and after reading Gopi Krishna's books and having an opportunity to meet him and hear his philosophy of life and the knowledge that comes through him firsthand, I couldn't resist the opportunity. I enjoyed meeting Gopi Krishna very much. He had been sort of a, 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 a character, and then all of a sudden he became real, and everything that I'd heard about him just materialized, and he... He was just an incredible, incredible person. He was in some, way, some ways, when I think about it, when we came back, it was like a dream. We went over to India and we sat in front of one of the most incredible men who is alive today. Oh, I feel so terrific ever since I got back. And I feel for the first time in my life I am going in the right direction. The moment that um, I met Gopi Krishna, the feelings came to the surface on the very first day he was there because the tears were always very close. My feelings were just overwhelming in the whole 10 days that we were with I discovered how close I was to 234 people and that that closeness we could share with, with strangers, with people in India whom we had never met before and they could become a part of our group. obviously one of the greatest metaphysical books in the world, but I think over a long period of time, with dogma and organized religion, people have gotten away completely from what it really means. And perhaps until today, man has never evolved to the point where he could really understand what the Bible was saying. And maybe now is a new time to reinterpret it and maybe get closer to the true meanings of some of the things that it says. And this is one reason that I think this organization has so much to offer.